Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is all about my evening skincare routine and doing my skincare in the evening and taking my makeup off is my most favourite part of the day. Um, I've always loved skincare and different products and I have suffered with acne in the past and it's left with some scarring on my on my cheeks so um, I've been using the Derma Roller from the Swiss Clinic um, for the past three weeks and it, I've really noticed a massive difference in my skin um, it's not only just for acne scars it can be for wrinkles or just overall general skin health and um, texture so um, I've added this into my routine and I thought I'd show you exactly how I do it. So the first thing I do is put my hair up and then I take my eye makeup off and I have false lashes so what I do is I use the um, Nivea eye makeup remover uh, for the makeup underneath my eye and any makeup on my eyebrows and then any eyeliner or eyeshadow on my actual eyelids I use the Lash Perfect um, special gentle eye makeup remover so it won't sort of dislodge any of my lashes um, because these lashes are a lifesaver to me. When I'm using the Lash Perfect makeup remover I always make sure just to use a cotton bud and just dab it on um, exactly where the makeup is because you don't want to swamp your eye in loads of eye makeup remover because it will dissolve, the, the eye makeup remover will dissolve the glue of the eyelashes. But after I take my eye makeup off then I'll always comb my lashes through just to make sure that they're not sort of all crossed or crooked um, and that there's no dust or debris in them. After my eye makeup's off I'll take my main makeup off with the Clarins One Step Cleanser and it's really nice it smells like peach and you just put a little bit on to two cotton pads and just wipe it all over your face and it will take all your makeup off. Um, so I use that and then afterwards I use to actually clean my skin. I use the Oskia Renaissance Cleansing Gel, which is one of my favourites. I love it. And um, so what I do is I just put some in my hands, warm it up, and then apply it to my face and just massage it in. And this will get rid of any last bits of makeup and also dissolve any dead skin cells um, that are on your skin. So after I give that a good massage in, I will get a flannel and get it under some hot water and then just put it over my face and remove the cleanser. Now it's time for the derma roller. So every time I use it, I make sure to sanitize it after I use it so it's clean ready for my next time. And I bought the sanitizer that comes with the derma roller from Swiss Clinic and you just spray it a few times, leave it to dry and it's completely sanitized. So the most important thing is that your face is clean. So I always do this after my skincare routine. Um, before I put any moisturizers or serums on. So what you do, what you want to do is hold it vertically um, to your face and just roll up and down and you want to go over each area four times. So one, two, three, four. So each roll is a time. So roll, roll up is one time, roll down is two times, up three, down four. And then on that same location you want to change the direction of the derma roller and go diagonally. So you want to go up four times and then diagonally four times, diagonally the other way four times. And you can increase the pressure um, as you like it. So I don't particularly feel like it hurts. It's, it's not, it can be a little bit uncomfortable around like the thinner areas of your skin on your face, but you can increase the pressure if you if you want to. Which The reason I use a derma roller is because they, the, there's tiny little needles all around the side and what they do is they actually prick the skin um, but they prick the deep layers of the skin, which is where my scarring is um, and wrinkles are, and they will cause like trauma to the sort of deeper parts of your skin, which in turn makes all the collagen rush to that area, thinking, "Oh, there's trauma. Let's let's mend it." So it will mend that, that minimal trauma that the derma roll has caused. But then in turn, it will mend anything else that's sort of there that might have been forgotten about. So that is the that is how it works. Um, it also helps all your products sink in a lot deeper into the skin. So I do that all over my face and I do it for seven days and then I have a seven day break and then I do it for seven days again. And you want to be really careful. Um, you can buy some derma rollers on Amazon and eBay but if I, was, if I was you I would buy one from a reputable brand like Swiss Clinic. Um, somewhere you know that they're going to be 
someone you know and that you can trust. Um, I also brought the rejuvenating serum that you use after you use the derma roller, and I used that, and I used that once I finished and quickly put it all over my face. And once that's synced in, I'll finish off with the Clarins Blue Orchid Face Treatment Oil, and that just makes sure that everything is sort of locked in and I'm nice and nourished. And I'll put a big thick layer of that on, and sleep with it on and then I will finally emerge from the bathroom and go downstairs and join my husband on the sofa and he will always ask me what have you been doing up there you've been ages but it's just a little nugget of my day that I like to do and I like to spend some time and try new products and take my makeup off and do my derma roller so I hope you enjoyed watching this video and I'll see you again in my next one bye